Hi, Rhett Nelson here with EastIdahoNews.com. I am here today at the Idaho Falls Air Rescue Hangar at the Idaho Falls Airport, joined by Sean Powell, who's the pilot with Air Rescue, and uh, the registered nurse, uh, Becky Reese. Powell is a rotor wing pilot who flies Air Idaho's A-Star 350 helicopter directly to the scene of the accident, helps load the patient. This can support about a 500 pound person. And quickly transports them to the nearest hospital as a nurse treats them en route. Becky Reese, a registered nurse with Air Idaho, says an RN and a medic is on board every flight who is certified in air medical operations. Common patients at this time of year probably are tourists, I would imagine. Most of them are tourists and a lot of them come from below sea level or at sea level and so they, they come up to elevation. So a lot of uh, patients that we see have respiratory issues or cardiac issues and so we're able to intervene and implement what they need to, to make sure that they stay alive. Air Idaho Rescue owns three helicopters and a Pilatus PC-12 airplane to respond to emergencies. James Jarvie is a registered nurse on the airplane's medical crew. He says they can use the aircraft in many different ways. We've done this before where we've had a rotor go into a remote area where there's multiple patients. We'll land at the closest airport and they will bring us a patient. We'll head to the hospital with that patient while they go back and get another patient. Jarvie says the vast majority of calls have a positive outcome for the patient. In Idaho Falls, I'm Rhett Nelson, eastidahonews.com.